Hey y'all, it's Tickle Bits. Now they call me Tickle Bits because I make bits with Tickle Ya. Some of y'all might not, not know this about me, but it's my lifelong dream to get me and my wife Jean on the Family Feud. And we figure, hey, going viral is the perfect way to do it. And we're just getting on this TikTok thing, but we're having some fun. Now I sent Stoney on the Sobros Network website was writing about them Bigfoots the other day and I thought hey man they got all them shows on the television where them boys get out in the woods and they go hunt them squawk squatches and I thought hey it's it's spooky season we're looking for some spooky kind of stuff around here I got a daggone worm crawling up my leg never mind it's just my dick anyway I figure hey you see all them guys on them TVs that get get together in them woods and they go hunting them squash squatches and I thought man people just eat that shit up so maybe that's our ticket to going viral during spooky season what we can do me and my wife Jean can do out here at my ranch because since it is spooky season there ain't no better time to make spooky season content because it's spooky season Rule number one about hunting for Bigfoots is you gotta bang on some trees. All right, that's how them yetes talk to, to one another. I'd recommend finding the biggest, the girthiest stick you can find. Well, I reckon this one will do. Now, the harder you hit the sun, bitch, the more Bigfoot, <laughs> did you hear that, Jane? I call them Bigfoots. The more Bigfoots, you're gonna bring. So you just want a rear back and you just want to swing for the fences. Here come the big foots. It didn't work like I drew it up, Gene. Is this a real tree? Yeah, it feels real. Them big foots like real trees, Gene, so we gotta make sure we got the best equipment. I think it might have been the stick. You might want to smear piss all over yourself too when you're doing this. What? Don't smear the piss? I smear piss on myself every morning. I thought animals love piss. That's I love animals. I want them to come to me. So I smear I, every morning. I put on my cologne. I put on my aqua velva. And I smear a little bit of pee pee on me. Cause I want the animals come. Hey, you learn something new every day. Maybe I shouldn't be doing that. Next thing we want to do is we want to make some calls. Cause that's how these yetes talk to one another. It's kind of like a monkey and a dingo had a baby and uh, it had a real like whoop to it. You know what I'm saying? I think I even read somewhere, Gene, that uh, I think these these Bigfoots, they that they they really like dingoes. That some of them even keep them as a pet. Whoop, whoop, howl, whoop. What do you mean these things only come out at night, Gene? Why are you just now telling me that? That well, well ba baby, we can't do this now. Ain't no Bigfoots gonna come up. They come out at night. You, you tell they come out at night. No, baby, I love you, but you, you could, I would have appreciated you telling me that up front. Ain't no use in doing this now. We better just shut her down. Ain't no Bigfoots around. I don't think they're coming unless they come out at night. Maybe they'll come out later. Maybe they're just chilling in the woods. They heard me talking and a whooping. Maybe they're thinking like, hey, yeah, we can come out later tonight, but it's daytime. So we can't come out right now. I don't know. This day might have been a bust, but we can rescue it. So put your bra on. We go into the Waffle House. Well, we didn't catch no Bigfoots, but but Gene, look, we drew up a mess of dang turkeys. I think one of the neighbors, one of the neighbors is watching this. That's great. <laughs> 